Hi, fellow bird watching enthusiasts. Are you struggling to record and manage BirdBoss camera footage on your PC? Well, you're in the right place now. In today's video, I'm going to share some valuable tips and tricks to make this process seamless and enjoyable. So recording and managing BirdBox camera footage holds immense importance for birdwatching enthusiasts. It allows enthusiasts to capture rare and fascinating bird behaviors, creating a valuable record for future reference and research. Organized footage management assess enthusiasts in sharing their findings with the birdwatching community, fostering education and awareness about various avian species. And recording and managing birdbox camera footage enrich the birdwatching experience, providing enthusiasts with a wealth of knowledge and a deeper connection to the avian world. So selecting a suitable bird box camera is paramount for effective bird watching and wildlife observation. The right camera ensures clear and detailed footage capturing the avian's behaviors. Factors such as camera resolution, lens quality, and load lights performance are crucial. So here we have two bird box camera. This one here is the wireless bird box camera. It has a 2.5 mm wide angle lens, provide a wide angle view that's about 120 degree with the adjustable focus feature. It can produce 3 MP ultra high definition color images by day and deliver crisp black and white images by night with invisible IR infrared LEDs. And this one we have the IP bird box camera. This one here is utilizing PoE technology, offering robust network reliability to secure a better bird watching experience by transmitting both power and data to the bird box camera at the same time. And both of the camera are protected in an IP66 rated casing. So you can even place it outside of the bird box without any risk of the rotor increase. So by using our bird box camera, you can not only view the video footage on your mobile device, you can also feel it on a PC. As you can see, I already connected the whole camera and mounted into the birdhouse. And it's already connected to the application. Today we're using a PoE bird box camera. It has PoE technology, allows both power and data to be transmitted over a single Ethernet cable. So eliminating the need for a separate power source. So I'm going to move on to a PC and show you how to connect the camera. So now we're in front of a PC and I already downloaded a software called VMS that is specifically designed for recording of Burbox camera footage. Now I'm going to show you how to use it. This is the VMS. I'm going to double click it. And you'll see the username and the password. You can set your own and then hit sign in. After you sign in, make sure you click on Add Devices manually. Then hit OK. Hit Menu Add. Change the IP address to Cloud ID since it's already connected to the internet. And where can you find the Cloud ID? Just going back to your phone application Hit setting under about, you'll see the whole serial number. Just copy it and open it up in anywhere so you can see the whole number and type it into the cloud ID. It's kind of long, so it'll take a little bit of time. Make sure you type it in correctly. And over here, it will ask you for the username and the password. If you already set a password for your camera, you can just type it in. If not, you can just leave it blank and hit OK. It will take a little bit of time for it to connect. Now it's already connected. So we're going back home under monitor
right click the camera and hit extra stream make sure you hit the extra stream so you can feel the video footage here we go so now I'm going to ask my colleague Natisha to move around the bird box camera so you can see they are on the same channel here we go not only you can feel your video footage on your phone, you can also feel it on a computer. Not only that, go back to home, you can also hit the playback button, click on the camera, search for day and time, and the recorded video footage will list it here. And also, go to device, record mode, device configuration, you can set everything in this software and also the system configuration everything is listed here so you can make adjustment through your computer and also the alarm configuration so that's it thank you very much for watching our video today if you have any questions feel free to leave a comment below and i'll see you in the next video